welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas, I'm your host, and I am here solo dolo for a very special season one in review episode of my San Francisco 49ers half play, half sim rebuild. Um, so what I want to do first is show you who made the playoffs and see who won the Super Bowl. Um, I still do not know who won the Super Bowl myself, so I'll find out with you guys. So it looks like uh, Tennessee beat the Steelers, the Saints lost to the Rams, the Texans beat the Pats, and the Bears beat the Eagles. So three of the four wildcard teams actually won their game. And then the Titans and the Bears won again, and the Chiefs won, and the Rams won. So as of right now in the championship games, Holy shit. So there's a wild card team. The Tennessee Titans are in the Super Bowl. And then the Rams will be in the Super Bowl against them. So it'll be the Titans and the Rams. Let's see who won the Super Bowl. Holy shit. The Titans. The Titans ended up beating the Rams in the Super Bowl. So season one, the, t the Titans have won the Super Bowl. So real quick, let me go ahead and run through the standings here. Um, for the league, it was, there was the north, the south, the east, the west, and then the NFC north, the NFC south, the NFC east, and the NFC west. Of course, there's me, the 6 and 10 49ers. So, I do want to show you where the team ended up. Last season, stats-wise, I played the first week and threw five interceptions, so I did really fucking bad for uh, <laughs> for Jimmy Garoppolo. So he only had nine other interceptions the entire season, so I really screwed the pooch on that. But So he ended up with 4,200 yards, 30 touchdowns. That's fucking pretty good. Rushing, McKinnon did end up with 1,000 yards. He had 1,100 yards. Rushing. Receiving, how did... uh? Marquise Goodwin and the Garkin, they both had over 1,000 yards. Goodwin had over 100 receptions. Look at him. Well, I guess when your fucking quarterback throws throws that much, I mean, you can't not be good. All right, so then we had Jimmy Ward here who had the most tackles on the team as a fucking cornerback. Great. That's going to be wonderful. So Fred Warner and then... My safeties. Holy crap, my linebackers suck. So did anybody have any sacks? Oh, Solomon Thomas, the right end. Had nine and a half. Left end. Backup left end. All right, not bad. How many interceptions did my team have? Not very many. All right, so War Ruben Foster, Ward, and Sherman. God, Sherman, he is a liability. So, all right, let me go ahead and jump in here and show you guys... Who won the yearly awards for the NFL? So it looks like um, Russell Wilson was the MVP. And who was coach of the year? The Falcons coach. All right, so then we're going to go to the AFC. I'm sorry, the NFC, because that's where I'm at, and see if any of my people ended up with any award of any sort. So Offensive Player of the Year, there's no 49ers there. Defense Player of the Year. No 49ers there. Fucking Khalil Mack, of course. So let's see here. Offensive rookie. Oh my god, dude. I am not looking very good here. So let's go to defensive rookie. Oh, hell yeah. Fred Warner. Look at that. Finally a guy who is doing something. Best quarterback. Def wow. He had 4,200 yards and 30 touchdowns. He's not even in the top seven. All right, that's fine. All right, my running back, nope. Wide receivers, oh, God, holy shit, tight. Nope, the lines, nope. Defensive ends, nope. Linebackers, holy shit, dude. All right, Jimmy Ward, he finally, uh, he finally showed up sixth on the cornerbacks kicker. And Robbie Gould is my kicker. Yeah, he was the best kicker. Great. <laughs> and he's old. So, 
All right here, let's see if there's anything else really to show on the year in review. Um, I guess I, I can show you where the team is as far as uh, going into the offseason. This is where they ended the season at. Um, Skills-wise, Garoppolo was an 84, McKinnon 86. Uh, let's see here. Juice check. My team is old, dude, and the guys who aren't old aren't very good. So I'm going to definitely do some rebuilding here in the offseason. I'm going to try to trade some of these players uh, and see what I can and see what I can have happen. So Joel Staley, he's probably going to retire. He's old as shit. So, all right, my line is not very good. No, it's definitely not very good at all. So, all right, maybe I'll try to beef up the line. I mean, the line definitely helps. And then uh, defensively, is that my strong suit? I mean, who was the guy that, where was my uh, rookie? That I don't even know where the hell that guy is. Um, Let's see here, left, oh my god, left outside linebacker is my worst position by far. Oh, he's a, he's a middle linebacker. So, he was a part of the rookie of the year, so maybe I should switch my defense to a 3-4. Oh my god, no I shouldn't. Holy crap. Alright, and then, god, yeah, other than... Other than uh, Richard Sherman, yeah, I got some pretty terrible cornerbacks. Holy shit. Alright, alright. Damn, guys. I have, a lot, I have a long way to go. I'm hoping that I, they can make the playoffs so I can play them, but holy crap, no wonder they went 6-10. and 10. So where are my picks at? I got pick, the 8th pick, 40th pick, so I don't have a fifth round pick out, so I have, what, six draft picks? All right. So that's really what I'm going to do here. And I'm going to um try to make them better. I'm not, I mean, I'm sure there's a lot I can try to do. So that'll be here on the next video, uh, the off season. So, all right, guys, that is all that we have for this video for the season one in review. Um, please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Don't forget, we also have a podcast here at The Crazy Town. It is available on iTunes and SoundCloud and pretty much anywhere else. Links are in the description. We also host the podcast here on the YouTube channel. Check it out. It's pretty good. It's with my uh, co-host, TNT Dynamite. He's on a lot of my other videos here, and those are our videos, and these are mine. So, And he has a Dark Souls playthrough he's doing, too. So... All right, guys, so I will catch you on the next video for the off season where I try to progress my team. And uh, for Jonas, I am out.